Yeah, well, that one morning I went down to surf Waimea and it was like, like massive. And, um, it was like slightly onshore and then, you know, where the bathrooms are, like waves were coming up into the, like, over the sandbank, over by the bathroom and going into the parking lot. Mm. <laughs> it was big, man. I was like, wow. And then the only guy I saw was your uncle Eric. He had like this football, it's heavy. He had this football jersey on and he had this huge board. And then he was just like running down to the, the paddle out spot, like, just sprinting like full on. <laughs> just you know, paddle out. And the chops on the inside was so big, like you couldn't even see him. Because you know, you paddle out like two little chops and stuff. Mm -hmm. It's like, oh, where is he looking? I was like, oh. he's out there somewhere. And then I just see somebody like, it's still real dark. Mm -hmm. See him, somebody coming down this huge wave, like, I was like, oh, there he is. <laughs> was, came right through the bay, um, through the shore break, like, he rode the wave all the way through the shore break, prone down, <laughs> rode it, like, by the bathrooms, like, past the bathrooms. And then, right, he came up on the beach, I was like, oh, that was heavy. I thought he was done. And he grabbed his board and he ran like full blast, like straight <laughs> back to the, to the point. Like down to, by the point again and yeah, paddle back, back out. How big was it that day? That's it. I saw a 30 foot set. And I think he was the only guy that was going to paddle out, yeah. That's when they canceled the eddy because it was too big. Yeah. I think yeah, I, this one was weird. Like this wave, like this is Waimea Bay. Uh -huh. And normally everybody takes off over here. Like 20. Yeah, yeah. Had this wave that broke in the middle, like it was weird. He was the yeah. only guy like on the beach, like waiting. Yeah. To go.